Am I the asshole? For arranging childcare far away from my wedding reception. I got married this summer. And while I wanted a child-free wedding I realized that this would exclude a lot of my friends and family. So I came up with what I thought was a good compromise. I rented out my brother's indoor playground and paid the staff to work late. Basically I paid them double time until midnight whether there were kids there or not. They are all trained in first aid and have all been screened by the police. On top of that several of the older kids that didn't want to go to the reception stayed there as well to keep an eye on everything. As well as two ladies from my church. I also provided food and drinks. The problem is that the playground was about two miles away from the reception. So you basically had to choose between leaving you kids there or bringing them with you. I figured that it was a good option for anyone with kids that might get rowdy. Anyone with infants obviously wouldn't leave them there. Boy was I wrong. People were mad that it was so far away. About a five minute drive. They were mad that the kids didn't get the same food as the people at the reception. No, they got pizza, nachos, and fried chicken. They were mad I didn't have someone to watch nursing babies. I was cool with people bringing babies to the reception. There was a mother's room at the hall for nursing and changing babies. I have been called all kinds of names for what I honestly thought was a nice thing. My husband said we should just have gone child free and dealt with that hate instead of wasting money on ingrates. My aunt actually called me an asshole for not wanting a couple of dozen screaming and crying kids at the reception. Two miles. When I read your title I was thinking it was like a 45 minute drive and anyone with smaller kids would be worrying. This is so not an issue. Not the asshole. Not the asshole this is the best solution I've heard on here from anyone who wanted a child free wedding. You provided multiple options for people to choose from, put the kids there where they have fun with others their age, get your own babysitter or stay home. Whoever still had a problem was looking for one. Also, who gets mad at different food options? What you provided sounds way more kid-friendly than what was probably at the wedding. Damned if you do and damned if you don't. Not the asshole. Not the asshole oh my gosh what a generous and lovely thing to have arranged for the children of your family and friends I would have had a blast at a place like that as a kid. I would have thought the parents would have appreciated a free night out off. What is wrong with people these days? Not the asshole. That sounds like a lovely compromise, and I bet the kids were happier there than they would have been at a wedding reception. Let's face it not many five-year-olds really want to sit through a long ceremony and a bunch of speeches, or to eat fancy grown-up wedding food. My kid self would have much preferred the pizza also, when you said it was far, I was picturing somewhere much much further away that five minutes down the road face with tears of joy. Not the asshole. At least now you know what whiners you should avoid inviting to any future events. When did everyone become entitled to their vision of perfect, free, immediately accessible childcare serving the menu of their choice? SMH. Info in what backwards reality is two miles considered far? I'm reading comments like what if someone's kid got injured and they're all that distance away. Ah, well then worst case when no motor vehicle is functioning you can sprint and be there in 15 minutes. Not the asshole. Nta. Other than the complaints did the reception turn out as you wanted? Definitely not the asshole. You went way beyond what most people do for child-free weddings. You are honestly a superstar of a bride. Your family friends sound like a bunch of ungrateful people I'm inclined to think your husband is right, that you spend a lot of money and still were totally hated on. Honestly this is amazing you went way above the call of duty and people are awful. Not the asshole mom of four, I would slam dunk my kids in that indoor playground and then add whatever I would have spent on a babysitter to your wedding gift. What a thoughtful, considerate solution. Bonus, I guarantee the kids were happier with pizza and play equipment than at a sit-down dinner you sound like an incredibly thoughtful bride. Not the asshole. 
I'm sick of parents acting like they need to take their kids everywhere I hate that they don't want to my kids at their wedding and then acting foolish when childcare I is arranged. You did more than I would have, you were gracious. Not the asshole. They got free babysitters, their children would have an amazing time and they can calmly enjoy the wedding. People are stupid. Not the asshole. They can say whatever complaint they like, but what I hear is your childcare option means I can't get wasted because I have to drive to pick up my kids. Not the asshole. This is the perfect definition of give an inch and they want a mile. A five minute drive isn't far away. It sounds like they essentially expected you to have a child room 80 the reception where they'd get the same food and the parents could go check on them between songs. I think you're bloody amazing. I've never heard of anyone going to that effort, an expense for wedding guests. Usually it's just child free, and parents make their own arrangements. As others have said, it seems a case of damned if you do damned if you don't. Please don't let people bring you down. You went above and beyond to try and be accommodating. Definitely not the asshole oh and congratulations. Not the asshole. People are jerks, you did a lot more than many would, enjoy your life and congratulations. Not the asshole people suck. This is such a wonderful idea. But yeah can't please everyone. I guess child free next time jokes. Not the asshole. Wow, how ungrateful can people be? What's the chances you could find a suitable, ready-made venue any closer? Very low, I think. WTF. Your arrangements were perfect. Two whole miles. You monster. JK. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. My mom always said, no good deed goes unpunished. Sorry you had to deal with ingrates. Not the asshole if I were a kid I would have preferred this over the wedding reception. Hanging out with kids my own age heavy checkmark hash. 100x better food heavy checkmark hash. No parents heavy checkmark hash. I thought this was very thoughtful and well thought out. You would have thought it was a win-win. But you still got the screaming and crying kids at the wedding, it sounds like they're very big screaming and crying kids. The so-called adults being and whining about the arrangements. You're right about them being ingrates. It sounds like you had a perfect setup. Not your fault you have so many adult relatives that act like toddlers. Not the asshole. Not the asshole. I'm getting married soon and I don't want kids and my reception ceremony. I've gotten a lot of flack for it but I tell them unless you're planning on paying for the wedding you get no say. If you can't afford to get childcare, sure, I'll chip in but you're also very free to not come. Far away a 5 minute drive is far away. Are y'all in Texas because that sounds like something my native Texan friends would say? Rolling on the floor laughing face with tears of joy when I clicked, I was thinking like across town or 20 or 50 miles. Seriously though, not the asshole. My husband said we should just have gone child free and dealt with that hate instead of wasting money on ingrates. He's correct. You did awesome. People are just assholes no matter what you do. Not the asshole. Not the asshole you went above and beyond for these kids, screw the people who complained, if they thought it was fine, they would have found something else to complain about. I wish you a long, happy, healthy life together. Not the asshole. I bet those kids talk about that for years. They got to have a wonderful time free of parents. Ignore the complainers. They just want something to complain about. Not the asshole, that honestly sounds like a perfect solution compromise. Parents don't need to choose between finding a babysitter and staying home and getting the chance to relax and have fun at the wedding, kids will have a blast and I bet the kids are much happier with their food options. Not the asshole. You did a great thing. Anyone who was upset about it should be on your list to cut out of your life and go no contact with. 
how entitled and ungrateful they were. People were mad that it was so far away. About a five minute drive. Oh what the fuck did I just read? Five minutes drive is far away? Not the asshole. 3.2 kilometers. And that's too far, you can be there in two minutes. Not the asshole. I thought you were talking the next down over or something. People are just looking for something to be a holes about. Not the asshole. What kid is going to want fancy wedding food? Pizza nachos and fried chicken at an indoor playground sounds awesome no offense but it sounds more fun than a wedding to me. My only complaint would have been the kids get to have more fun. I mean you provided them with everything, so I think